Hello, this is Annette with Project Refine Life. Welcome to my channel. Today we are here for a different type of deck review. These are kids yoga decks. I know this is not tarot and it is not oracle, but I went to the Dollar Tree the other day. I found these decks for $1.25 each and I thought I'll pick them up and see if it's worth it or not for $1.25. What do you have to lose? So I also brought out this kid's yoga deck to compare to these yoga deck. And then also this little yoga dice. That's what I'm calling it, a yoga dice ball that I also have. So let's go ahead and review these decks. Now, one thing I will say right off the bat is you are going to see a reflection of the fan up above. I'm in Arizona and it gets hot here. So. I'm not turning off the fan because I will melt. <laughs> All right. So these are the cards. The, the card stock is really nothing to write home about, but you guys, they're $1.25. Keep that in mind, okay? They come with 32 poses. They come in beginner and advanced. This is the beginner deck. Everything is color coordinated. So you have blue, you have this orange color here, green and pink in the beginner deck. So all of the colors correspond with a type of pose. So the pink are standing, the green are seated poses, the orange are back bends, and the purple are resting poses with the blue being balancing poses. So let's go ahead and just take a look at the deck. And the reason that I took it out of here is because um, I would have struggled. See how this is? Everything gets stuck in here. But remember, guys, remember, $1.25. So I took it out off of camera so that way you wouldn't have to see me struggle with that. So here we go. This is the beginner deck. So standing poses, we have Jellyfish, Warrior 2, Warrior 1, palm tree. Now keep in mind that some of the poses have been changed. The name of the poses have been changed to kind of appeal to kids a little bit more. Mountain pose, downward dog, extended side angle, triangle, road runner, standing half forward bend, crescent lunge, pyramid, deer, cloud, Butterfly, Seated Forward Bend, Frog, Staff, Head to Knee, Wide Angle Straddle, Bridge, Knees to Chest, Cat, Cobra, Cow, Happy Baby, Supine Spinal Twist, Child's Pose, Corpse, Tree, Plank, and three-legged dog. Now, as I'm going through these cards, <laughs> I have to say that I can think of quite a few people who would probably really like these decks and the art within the decks. They're really cute. Okay, let's move on to the advanced yoga deck. And again, all the colors on the back coordinate, oops, that one's out of order, all of the colors on the back coordinated with the type of pose that's associated with that color. So here we are with standing poses, garland, standing head to big toe, revolve triangle, revolve side angle, reverse warrior, prayer twist, lord of the dance, king dancer, upright seated angle, monkey, lotus, fire log, flowering lotus, Boat, Supine Spinal Twist, Pigeon, Camel, Upward Facing Dog, Happy Baby, Corpse, Child's Pose, Tortoise, Standing Split, Plow, Warrior Seal, Standing Head to Knee, Extended One-Legged Pigeon, Crane, Peacock, Handstand, Half Moon, and Eagle. 
Now, one thing about the advanced versus the beginner deck is in the advanced, you have yellow and orange. So the yellow is for the um, resting poses. And that's the only difference there. So between these two decks, the beginner and the advanced, you have a total of 64 cards to work with. I think that's a pretty good deal, guys. I am pretty impressed with those cards. Like I said, the cardstock is nothing to write home about, but they're $1.25, guys. You know, if they fall apart, it's not a big deal. Okay, here's the next deck that I have, and this is the kids' yoga deck. It's 30 poses and games. So it comes with this little, um, you know, dear parents, dear kids, how to use the deck, um, reminding kids of the benefits of yoga, kids and parents, um, using the deck activities and strings of poses. So strings of poses actually means flow, a flow of poses. So instead of calling it a flow, they call it a string and it gives like a whole layout here, basic string, sleepy string, rainbow string, energy string. So it's just a few poses, but it's enough to get somebody going. And then here, all the poses are colored as far as what type of pose they are, what series of poses, what type of asana, a little dedication, and um, I think that's the beginning of it. And it does come, like I said, in this really nice box, but of course, there is a big price difference. Now, these cards here, I think, are really geared more towards older kids or even adults. Now, on the back, it does have the name of the card, the associated pose, how to do the pose, like a step-by-step, -step, ideas to try the pose, like here it says, try this pose every day for a week and try sitting with flower pose back to back with a friend and try sitting in flower pose in a circle with many of your friends. So there's many ways that you can use the deck, but again, see like that, you know, these, these are nice, but this goes for an older audience as far as kids are concerned or even adults. Um, there's many ways to do these, like some you have to know to like, Kind of put it upside down there um, but this is a nice deck as well the cardstock is of course much nicer but it's it's a pricier deck so I'll just go ahead and keep going through the cards so you can get an idea I'm not going to name off each one because really the comparison was really just to show you this deck in comparison with that Dollar Tree deck and um, looking at these now, to tell you the truth, <laughs> I really prefer the Dollar Tree deck. It is really much cuter and a little bit more uh, inviting than this deck. Here I go. I always got to throw some cards on the, on the floor here. Um, there's a little mudra in there. Anyhow, these are definitely more advanced and kind of prefer the other deck more. Okay, now this little thing is something else that's kind of fun to bring into the mix. This is a little yoga dice, and I found this at five below, and it was five bucks when I bought it. I've had it for a while now, but as you can see, you just roll it, there's a pose that comes up, and you would just do that pose. But it's another way to get kids or adults interested in doing, even if it's just a pose a day, something to consider. That is my little um, review of these cute little decks. And like I said, these are at the Dollar Tree, but I have some really good news for you because I was really curious to see if there was something between the beginner and the advanced decks. I went on to Amazon to give it a search and guess what? I found them on Amazon. You can get both of these decks. They come sold as a pair for $4.41. At the time that I'm looking at this, it says that there's only two left. They'll probably restock, I'm not sure. But if you have somebody or know somebody that lives near a Dollar Tree, maybe they can pick some up for you if you're interested in them. This deck right here is $18.43, although on my box, 
the US pricing here. Let's see if it can, it's not going to um, focus here, but it says $14.99 US. So I don't know if you could find that for less, maybe at a bookseller if you are interested in that deck, but these little decks right here are really cute. The art is really cute. It's a good amount of cards for $2.50, or even if you pay $4.41 on Amazon, they're really cute. So that's it. That is my review of the kids' decks and this little ball right here. Thank you very much for tuning in, guys. I appreciate you guys all so much. I wish you a wonderful day, and I will see you later.